everyone, today I have my chef's hat. But does that make me a chef? Hmm, no. I have my friend's doctor's coat. But does that make me a doctor? No. Just because I have the right clothes does not mean I have the right skills for the job. You see, as Christians, we want to be more like Jesus, right? In the book of Ephesians, chapter 4, verse 24, it says, Put on the new self, created to be like God, in true righteousness and holiness. So my question is, how do we become more like Jesus? Can I just put it on? No, we have to ask God, our commander in chief, to change us from the inside out. What? He changes us from the inside out? Yes. And today, Shannon's going to explain and help us understand what this means. Hi everyone, we can't really tell what a person is like on the inside by looking at the outside, right? This was true for a man named Saul. We read about him in the book of Acts. Saul was completely transformed when he chose to follow Jesus. Now that is true for our lives too. When we choose to believe and follow Jesus, he does a deep work in our hearts, in our lives, in our godliness, in our friendships, in our love, in our perseverance and our courage and our bravery. God does that work within us, but not by our strength, but it's through Him. It flows through us from His power and His strength through us. God used Saul as an instrument to go tell many people the good news about Jesus. And do you know that God has that same plan and purpose for our lives when we put our faith in Him? Now, I bought this banana with me today. This banana is yellow. And it looks like it's just an ordinary banana on the outside. But when I peel it open, let's take a look at what this banana looks like. It has been cut into pieces, into bite-sized pieces that you and me can eat. And that is exactly how Jesus transforms our lives from the inside out. Wow, thank you, Shannon. I understand now. We can't just judge from the outside. We have to look at the inside too, just like God did with Saul. And as Christians, we need to make sure that our lives show that God is living in our hearts, inside and out. <laughs> 